Hello guys, welcome back to my channel Automation Hub Sathak and in today's video, I'll just show a very simple thing is like how to disable info bar. Chrome is being controlled by automated software which generally pops up under the Chrome browser, uh, you know, uh, the wherever you enter the URL. Uh, it comes up just below it as an information, but sometimes we don't want this. Uh, I did show this in my Chrome options videos a couple of years before, but that is not working anymore because the Chrome options class as a class it changes so much a lot of methods become deprecated if you go to google and just type chrome options class in selenium you will see a lot of things chrome options selenium so just go ahead and uh, see this particular class chrome options so a lot of things keep deprecating so they have a separate section of deprecated methods you know uh, there are a lot of instance methods, lot of uh, also we'll see all the methods and here you will find a lot of things uh, which we need to do. But my intention is that I want to uh, use a particular method which will help me to not see that Chrome, uh, that info bar. Okay, so we'll directly go here. So this is a simple code which I have written just to open Google. So I'll right click run as and I'll just execute this code. You will see a browser will open and you see here, Chrome is being controlled by automated test software. I don't want this. So automated test software, I don't want this, okay? So I don't want this statement in my, uh, you know, in my output, browser output. I want to remove this. So I'll simply use Chrome options. Okay, now before I go ahead and write the code, uh, Please be noted that if maybe after six months or after a year, uh, this particular method becomes deprecated or something new comes up and this doesn't work. See, as of now, right now in May 2023, I'm using Selenium Java 4.9.0. This is the Selenium Java version, this dependency I'm using right now. And I'm going to write the code. I cannot take the guarantee this will work in, you know, next May 2024. So I'll just create the object of Chrome Options class. And then I will dis so to disable the info bar, what you have to do is you have to write this. You will have to use the options reference and you have to call the method which is known as set experimental option. Here there is a key value, and here you have to pass. Uh, the uh, the key as a string okay and here the value will be in terms of an object okay so and we will be using this so the key which will be used is excludes exclude uh, switches i hope i'm writing the spelling correct exclude switches and the object or the value will be used by arrays dot as list so we'll use the arrays, okay? So we'll use this particular arrays from the java.util and here this object we'll call and here we will write enable minus automation and it will be disable, I make this screen bigger, disable minus info bars, okay? And that's it. If you want to use incognito mode, you can directly go ahead and write options dot add arguments incognito simple. And if you want to start maximize and do not want to do this, that is also fine. You can options dot add arguments. I generally use these three start minus maximized of course i used uh, page load strategy as well let me go ahead and write that option start set page load strategy page load strategy dot eager i generally use these three and then what you have to do you have to pass the options reference in the Chrome driver object constructor and that's it.
So we don't need the maximize method because it will start maximize. It will be run in incognito mode. You will see the black color background browser. And hopefully we will not see this info, info bar which we saw in a regular browser. So right click, let me execute this. Okay, it opens and now you see it is working absolutely fine. The info bar has been disabled. I do not know whether this thing will work after a year or six months because Chrome Options class changes a lot in terms of methods. A lot of methods get deprecated and all. Uh, keeping up to the deprecation and the current in use, I don't know. But as of now, this is working fine. So you can use this. And uh, if you want to make all these things in the Chrome Options as you know a static variable or normal variable, that's up to you. But this is it. Please use this. I will also add this particular statement uh, in my uh, YouTube video, you know, info information section. I will give it a hashtag and write it so that you can copy paste and uh, no need to remember this. No one remembers this. We all just use it online. Um, but thank you so much. Please do not forget to subscribe to my channel and keep sharing. Thank you so much. Safi here signing off.